The demonstration in Damango is part of a series of protests by the NDC against the outcome of the 2020 election results, which is being challenged by the party's 2020 flag bearer, John Mahama, at the Supreme Court following his insistence that it was rigged in favor of the MPP. Though the demonstrators burned tires and called for John Mahama to be declared winner of the December polls, leaders of the National Democratic Congress who led the protests in the Savannah Regional Capital say it was against the killing of their supporters in the December polls. The protesters took over the principal streets of Damango calling for justice. Leaders of the party, including first vice national chairman Chief Sufu Azoka and a former MP for Damango, Adam Mutawakiru, who joined the demonstrations, say they are appalled by the silence of the president and the police on killings in the election. The RGB is a man to come out and apologize to Ghanaians that they kill our seven people. Because of the seven people, we are demonstrating and we continue to And this Kokwanasi government, RGB gives them 6,000 security men. And our women, our mothers going to market, our robbers are disturbing them every time. No other security. But the deaths that occurred during the election and President Anna Kufuado hasn't shown any interest in finding justice for these people. Not for forgetting that of the Kimasa, where we they wrong, they lie. So these are the reasons why we want to protest and draw the international community and the country as a whole to that it took the intervention of party leaders to avert a near clash between the protesters and the police. This occurred after some of the protesters attempted to attack the regional police headquarters when some police personnel tried to stop them from burning tires on the street in front of the police headquarters.